We are at the New Literacies Teacher Leader Institute. This week, we're creating relationships among teachers from the United States and China. North Carolina and Chinese teachers are collaborating on project-based inquiry. As a new teacher, I'm excited to be part of a team with professionals who have been studying project-based inquiry and innovation for years. After this, you will be the experts in your building at PBI. And I feel like I can contribute to this team and help pave the way for other educators to innovate in the future. We're focusing on exciting academic content, cross-cultural understandings, and dynamic pedagogies and technologies. Oh, that's pretty good. One of the really cool text tools that we're using is uh, Quip, and Quip allows us to work with people uh, in different areas of the world simultaneously. We're also learning all about Badu cloud computing so that our students can be critical thinkers and evaluators of information. So they can actually use this type of software to collaborate together. One thing I have learned in this week is that I get to know what an innovative classroom looks like. One thing I have learned is how to analyze sources for my project and how to creatively synthesize evidence from my project. This week I'm learning how to ask a compelling question that will get my students to think outside the box. And I'm learning how to teach my students that all subject areas can be focused on global issues and solutions and how to use more technology in my classroom. Good. Love it. The knowledge that I learned here is very practical and uh, also I can learn some very advanced pedagogy and the technologies to facilitate my teaching. With the advent of new technologies and using them for global collaborations, we are allowing students to learn mathematics, science, history, and English in ways they haven't been able to do before. Woo!